Hey guys, welcome back to Splash Attack. So I have a lot of M25 packs to open and I want you guys to join me. So you might have spotted something different, which is this unstable pack up here. And like, I got it for free, so I'm just gonna open it. I really like unstable packs because they, every pack comes with value. Like lands, those full art lands are just beautiful. And I just want an unlimited amount of them. So we'll just crack this one open. Hopefully we get an island, or a, a mountain, or a forest. One of those three would be wonderful. So, as we can see already, well we can't see already, but let's, uh, let's go through, let's go through it quickly. Because we have a lot of packs to be opening. And we got a plains, which is not the worst. Oh, this is a really pretty vampire token that I like. So, we got a plains, that's not terrible. We can always use planes. And then the lovely vampire token. I want to sleep that up because, you know, you never know when I start playing vampires. Okay. All right. We will put this to the side. And let's get into this opening. First pack. Azusa. Alrighty. Let's try to open them neatly. Not drop them. I hate dropping packs because when I drop them... Oh man, oh man, when I drop packs, those corners get so messed up. And it's not just one, it's all of the corners. So let's not, let's not have a play of that. So I'm not aware of the pack trick yet. So Knight of the Skyward Eye, Dridge, Dridge of Dread, Brainstorm, awesome, I love this card. Echoing Courage, Uncaged Fury, Counterspell, another card that I love. Uh, Nihil Spellbomb, Arbor Elf, another great card, Kindle, I always get this confused with Lanor, Lanor, Lanor Elves, right? I'm not familiar with that yet, ooh, what a great uncommon, Curse Catcher, Nyx Fleece Ram, <laughs> cool, Browbeat, and, oh, oh. Whoa, what a nuts opening. First pack magic, guys. Imperial Recruiter. I think it's sitting at $30 or $40 around that range right now. And our foil of the pack is a uh, Court Hussar. And then we got a skeleton token. Wow, first pack magic, Imperial Imperial Recruiter. How amazing is that? Now, we're definitely going to speed things up, but I just wanted to enjoy that first pack. It looks like it's very nice condition. Great. Well, we don't want to mess anything up yet. We just got to get it in in good condition and preserve it. It deserves a good life. Well, why is it so hard to put it in? So, first pack magic, a mythic already. Holy cow. Wow, wow, wow. What a great first pack. All right. So, we have this in. Let's move these packs over. Sorry, guys. I should have set up the piles a lot better. But I will speed up this process, skip through the commons real quick, and we'll look at the uncommons. We'll get our amazing pile started right here with the mythics on top. Right? Mythics here. Uh, we'll put the commons and whatnot over here. We'll put the decent cards over here. And then, yeah. So, common, uncommon. Is everything... Viewable? Okay, so common, uncommon, and decent cards that I really like that I got from the packs. All right, sweet. Now we're all set up. We will go Jace. Jeez, that was a great first pack. Wow, Imperial Recruiter. Whew. What a nuts start to the opening. Craziness. Wahoo. All right, let's hope we didn't use up all the magic. Squad of the Heart, Ruthless, Trumpet Blast, Cloud Shift, Hidden. Nothing too memorable. Man of War, okay. Sweet, now we have the Uncommons. Swift Boots, a few dollars. Very nice card for Commander. Uh, Monk. We have this thing. Cascade Bluffs. Like 10 bucks, right? Relentless Rat. And then a Spirit Token. Sweet. 
And I guess I wouldn't mind having foils over here. Foils over here. What is this stuff? Oh, these are just the whatever cards. Cascade Bluff, $10. This might, might not even be $10 anymore. But let's just put the foils over here. Let's give them some love. All right. Next up, we have whoever, this Titan. I don't know the full name yet, but I'll figure it out soon. All right, guys. So let's just see real quick if we got any. Ooh, I like the lion. Another brainstorm. I think it's good for Popper, right? <laughs> Let me know in the comment section below if I skipped across anything. Oh, wow. Our uncommons are already here. Nice little lion. All right. So we have Veil of Arco, uh, Acros. All right. Acros. Twisted Image. Rancor. Oh, I think this is good. Oops, sorry guys. Fortune Thief and uh, Magnus Wheel. Okay. Well, they look like they're both rares. So a foil rare, probably not worth much. Runcore looks like it's worth quite a bit. Or maybe not, I don't know. Seems like a good card. I think I heard people talking about it. Alright, back to Azusa. Jeez, that first pack of Azusa. <laughs> Imperial Recruiter. How nuts was that? Oh my gosh. All right, let's hit, let's hit some more packs like that. Oh gosh, that was a terrible way to open the pack. Uh, Brainstorm, wow, Brainstorm's coming in like this slot in every pack. Brainstorm, Brainstorm, Storm, Storm, Storm. Perilous My, Meyer, Undead Gladiator, Invigorate. And then we got, ew, another fortune thief? Really? Wow, that was terrible. Okay, well then, we shall get keep it moving. That was really sad. All right, let's get a Jace out of a Jace pack to make things better. Holy cow, two fortune thieves? That's like misfortune thieves or whatever. Well, I guess in a way it does make sense. The fortune thief, thief stole our fortune, so yeah. So, we will skip through these. Cultivate is nice. I like the art on Ghost Ship. Lol seems cool. Alright, now we are up to here. Did, is that everything? I believe that's everything. Okay, so we have Braro. Okay, is it Focus? Bro Hatch Nantuko. Free from the real. Lore scale tall. It's nice. And we have a, a Chroma's Vengeance. And then we have a Ghost Ship Foil. I guess these two piles can be one in the same. Alright. Uh, our rare. Our uncommons. And then our token. Next up we have the Titan. Let's go. Lego. Wow. So far we haven't really hit anything. Well, sorry about that. Imperial Recruiter, but after that, that kind of went downhill quick. You know what, guys? I'll save the sorting for later. I'll just skip through the comments real quick, and then I'll go through the uncommons. Ihan's... Ihan's... Shade? Pyrochasm? Plasm? Sorry. Ordeal of... Heloi? Heloi? Oh, I suck at pronouncing. So we have Talia, Guardian of... Thrabin, which is good. And then we have this foil thing, and then some uncommons, and then we have the token. Let's grab all our rares out. Rare, rare, rare. And then I think that's all for the rares for now. Okay, so we got two fortune thieves, unfortunately. <laughs> Pun totally intended. Uh, Talia seems really, really good. I think she's a few bucks, maybe even 10. I don't know. We'll see. But I know she's one of the ones that's kind of not so bad pulling. So Azusa, do us some good. Show yourself, even. Let's do this. Alrighty. Focus, focus. Let's get into this. Cam Let's get this camera focused. Alright. So we'll go real quick. See if we got anything. Presence of good. Gone. 
Ooh, prophetic prism. Nice. Dark ritual. Ew. Can't believe they printed a Ixalan, the worst Ixalan dinosaur in here. Curse catcher is always nice to get. Treasure keeper seems cool. Caustic, caustic tar. And then our rare of this pack is, whoa. Sorry, I almost flipped that away. Rest in peace. And our foil is pillage. Destroy target artifact when it can't be regenerated. Okay, uh, that's cool. Moving on. Haven't gotten any cool foils yet. So we're up to Jace. Alright, let's do this, guys. We still got many, many more packs. Many, many more chances. And just so much more fun. Is this a diabolic, diabolic, edic, edic? Okay. Yo, this camera thing. I need to get a new tripod. Okay, okay, okay. Yo, no. Not seeing anything too super interesting. So we have a Genju. Of the Falls, first uncommon, Ravenous Chubacabra, ooh, Pernicious Deed, wait a minute, did we skip over, well, Pernicious Deed, and then we have a Sift, so it looks like we skipped over an, an uncommon, yep, Curiosity, totally ruined it for you guys, but alright, Pernicious Deed, I'm not sure about prices for this set yet, so I don't know if I pulled something really good, but alright, Let's open up one of these Titans, since we seem to have the most art from this. Alright, so we have this, that. Ooh, that's some cool, cool art. Alright, wow, blue. I love the art for blue elemental glass and red elemental glass. Ooh, lightning. Treasure Keeper. And our rare of the pack is... A Hell's Caretaker. Okay, and our foil. I saw red. I thought Imperial. But then it's a 5. This card's a 5-5, five five, so not really. Alrighty. Fair enough. Let's see. We have two Azusas, three Jaces, and probably four of these. Let's open these guys and these guys so that we have two of each pack left. Alright. We got this, guys. We got this. Lightning again. Zoltic Cavern. Willbender. And our rear of the pack is a Blood Moon. Hello. That's money right there. 20 bucks. And the foil is an Invigorate, which is not too exciting. But Blood Moon's always awesome. This card is just pretty nuts in general. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna sleeve it, double sleeve, because it's it's one of those cards that you should double sleeve. And it is minty fresh, pack fresh. Blood Moon's always a nice pull. Twenty dollar pull, not bad ever. A lot of people like that this was reprinted. It's funny that our two best cards are red. Let's get our a best card of blue, okay? We could we could do it. I'm pretty sure there's a Jace in one of these eight packs left. Oh, there goes Jace. Sorry guys, this is just going nuts. The camera's just going over the place. Well not the camera, I guess it's the tripod's fault. It's time to execute the tripod. Oh, let's see what we get in this pack. Alright, we are up to the uncommons. Goblin War Drum. That sounds cool. Creature to control have menace. Oh my gosh, that's nuts. Murder of Crows. Willow the Wisp. In our rear of the pack is a uh, Pendo Haven. Okay. And then we have a giant growth. And a token. Man, these foils are nuts. It's not that great. Wait a minute. You're not supposed to be over here. You're supposed to be over here. Alright, Jace. Do us some justice. Love getting Jace out of a Jace pack. Oh, wow. That just did not open properly. Oh, boy. Alright. Squadron. Squadron Hawk. Blah, blah. Savannah Lions. That's always a nice little... Ooh. Prophetic Prism. Sweet. 
Okay, so we have this and that. We have like one Arbor Elf, right? That's That seems to be short print. Stampede Driver, Humble Defector, Your Abyss Protector, and... Ooh. Mikoko... Mikokoro, Mikokoro, Center of the Sea. And then a foil, Horror of Broken Lands. Okay. Not sure how much these are worth, but we'll figure it out after. Now let's go from top down. Whoa, almost dropped it. Not a good idea. All right, last six packs, guys. Last six packs. Wish me the crazy luck. Unfortunately, we got double fortune thief, but that's been the only repeat, I believe. So that's a good thing. Well, getting a repeat of Imperial Recruiter isn't the worst thing in the world, right? It's a good. It's good. So we have Curiosity. We have Stang, which is awesome. I like Stang. Custic Tar, and our rear of the pack is a Twilight Mire, another dual land. Savannah Lion Foil, beautiful. Token. That wasn't a bad pack. I like these lands. They could be used for trading. Is this a Savannah Lion I see? Hello, Savannah Lion. I know you're one of the OGs in Magic. Dusk Legion Zealot. Ooh, Arbor Elf. Finally, another one. I wanted a place out of these. Sweetness. All right, so let's put that there. And we have our uncommons. Ooh, our foil is seen already. So, Croissant Colossus. Genju of the Spires. Ordeal of Heloid. And our rear of the pack is a Rugged Prairie. Prairie. Nice, Oh, So this is a rare foil. Ella Damari, Ella Damari's Call, Instant Search Library for a Creature Card, Reveal that card, and put it into your hand, then shuffle your library. Oh, it's a foil rare, we'll take it. Oh man, last four packs, what can we pull? Masters 25, is Jace not gonna come? I mean, Imperial Recruiters here, Jace will only be fitting, you know, 19 packs, we could do it. Jace is gonna be in this one. Oromancer, sta Supernatural Stamina, so Bright fl Flamekin, Loyal Sentry, blah, 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 blah. Ooh. Okay, so we got a Regrowth. Been looking for this card forever. Now I have like a bunch of them, but so. Shadow Mage, Infiltrator, Myriad Landscape, another Commander card, and a Flooded Groves. Jeez, we're getting all of them. We got a Foil Blightning, which looks so Super awesome. Oh, man. So I'm back. Hey, guys. So sorry because, like, while I was recording, something popped up and my phone stopped recording. And I opened two more packs before I realized. So after Flooded Groves, I got Rugged Prairie and Twilight Mire. And then that's when I looked up and I was just like, is this still focused? Wait a minute. It's not even recording. So... I got that all fixed up. I fixed up the pile a bit, but um, let's get back into opening these last three packs. Oh man. Oh man. Final last three pack magic. Wow, that first pack was such a tease. Imperial Recruiter is like 40 to 50. So we gotta really check and see, but I would like to, I don't know, I don't play it. So it's probably gonna be sold or traded away. Elvish Arbitration, Arcane Denial, Chandra's Outrage. Let's slow roll it since it's the ending. Disenchant, Self Assembler, Epic Confrontation. Oh my gosh, look at the teeth going everywhere. Skirk's Commando, Goblin Wardrum is our first uncommon. Urbis Protector, second. Third uncommon is Fierce Empath. Okay, Emp Empath. And. Living Wish. Interesting. And then we have a Blood Hunter bat. Oh boy. The disappointment in that pack is real. Living Wish. Yeah, I wish that it wasn't the rare. 
my goodness. All right, we got two more packs. We can do this. Azusa, come through, Za. All righty, here we go. All right. Dread, flaw, God's willing, plummet. Retraction Helix. This would be an awesome foil. Ghost Ship. Nice foil. Got it earlier. Disenchant. Low. I, I would love this as a foil. Not in this pack, though. Oops. Alright, so the commons are through. Now we have this card. We have a Regrowth. A Sigh of the Shinobi. And then we have... Oh, Cascading Bluff again. Not terrible. But, uh, we already got it. We don't need another one. Alright, guys. Last pack magic. Maybe we could hit something like this in the last pack. I mean, first pack we got the hit. Last pack, we're definitely going to get the hit. Jason's in this last pack. Watch. Just you watch. If you watch all my other videos, you will see that I speak a lot of things into existence. Such as... Speaking an Ascanta into existence out of an Ascanta, uh, of a, out of a, almost an Ascanta pack, out of an Exelon pack. So we have Nezumi Cutthroat, Crimson Mage, Brainstorm, I love this Brainstorm card. Inuk Survivalist, looks really cool, I don't like that as a foil. Disenchant, Low, Murder, Uncaged Fury, Total Lost, Totally Lost. Self-assembler. Alright, here we go. This is the final. Core Firewalker. Shadow Mage Infiltrator. Myriad Landscape. Oh boy. What is it? It's green. It's it's a summoner's pack. Whatever. And then last chance for the foil is a disappointment. Okay. Whoa, what happened to this foil? Look at it. What the heck? Oh man. Got so ruined. What happened to that? Ugh. Imagine that was a foil chase. Jeez. Alright, well, Summoner's Pack is an instant. Cool. Is Living Wish an instant? No, it's a sorcery. That's interesting that the instant is printed like that. Let me check out another instant. Does it have that green thing there? Wait a minute, that's a really weird looking instant. Was this green thing always there, guys? Huh, probably just a new way that they're printing stuff, right? Let's go check out another instant. No, it doesn't have that thing. So why does it have that? That's such a weird card. That's such a weird instant. None of the other instants have that green bullet point. Oh well, we'll figure that out later. But yeah, this was this was my opening. We did get some pretty cool heavy hitters and some not very heavy hitters. Uh, the dual lands are always nice. Talia is worth something for sure. I uh, can't say the same about all these other things. So what are our best? Blood Moon. Okay, so we have Imperial Recruiter, Blood Moon, Twilight Mire, Rugged Prairie, Flooded Groves, Talia, Cascading Bluffs, and Cascading Bluffs. Sweet. I guess these are the filter lands, right? I'm not even sure. But got one, two, three, four, five of them. And then Talia, which is very nice. And some other stuff that seems to be okay. Uh, I'm kind of disappointed that I didn't get Azusa, actually. Because I thought I would pull her. I mean, she's everywhere. Her price is dropping, so I can still pick her up when I get a chance. Or I can trade for her. Human Advisor. When an Imperial Recruiter enters the battlefield, search your library for a creature card with power 2 or less. Reveal it, put it into your hand, and then shuffle your library. So you put it? Maybe you can blink it? I don't know. Why is this so expensive? Asian guy. <laughs> Alright. Well... That was it for my opening. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if I got anything else good. And I'll have to start sorting. Alright, bye guys. Thanks for watching.